Good evening. Today is July 27th, and this is what I received today. Melissa, here's what I want you to deliver today. Today I want you to tell the others about the final countdown. We are about ready for liftoff. It is going to happen immediately. Do not fear, my children. Place your fears at my feet and look upward in hope. The day of your deliverance is here. It is about to happen. My children, who decides the day and the hour? How is this determined? I want you to know it is here. It is finally here, children. I am not talking in parables. The day is here at the door. I am going to do this, and you will soon see. Very soon, children, you are going to know. A peace will wash over you. It will be poured out, and you will be delivered. This does not mean you should stop living. Continue to carry out your daily tasks and assignments. Continue to worship me and wait, rest, and hope. Look up, children. I am coming. I know this is hard to believe. I have been gently preparing you for this hour. It is all coming into focus now. Children, I am going to do this. I will fulfill all that I have spoken through my prophets. They have been obedient and they have carried out the jobs I have given them. They do not know the day or the hour and they just speak what has been given to them. Look to me, children. Rest in me. Put your hope in me. I am coming for you. I am seated on the throne. I am the king of all kings, lord of lords. I am ruler of heaven and earth. I will accomplish it all. I am going to swing my iron scepter, and I will cast down the lies. They will, they will bow. Melissa, today is the day of your deliverance. Today you will realize all that has been given to you is a work for my glory and my honor. Today you will set the world on fire with these words. Today the fallen angels will shake and tremble. O oh daughter, it is here. The day is here. The world is about to turn upside down. I am going to do it. The baby is going to be birthed. It is all about to go down, Melissa. It is all about to be revealed. Daughter, listen. I am not going to say when. I will follow the command of my father, but it is eminent. The day and the hour do not matter. What matters is that it is all about to happen. You are going to be made ready. You are going to be restored. You are going to be able to be at peace with all that occurs. My children, ready yourselves. Prepare your hearts and still and quiet your minds. Focus on me. Love me and worship me. Cling to me, children. I will not forsake you. I love you, my children. I have loved you from the foundations of the earth. You are mine and I am yours. Soon you will know. Soon you will see. Soon you will be delivered. Take these words and share them today, Melissa. Do not fear. I will do it. And I'll put the scripture in the notes. Ephesians 5, 8, Lamentations 4, 6, Genesis 5, 2, Colossians 4, 2, James 1, 6 through 8. This one I wasn't sure about. Joshua 22, I think 1 through 27. Titus 2, 11 through 14. Galatians 3, 4, 5, and Galatians 5, 1 through 8. Hebrews 2, 6. Isaiah 32, 3, Mark 1, 1 through 9, Ezekiel 14, 3 through 5, Song of Solomon 2, 14. I heard the words, blessed assurance, promises kept. I love you, children. Revelation 18, 2, 1 John 2, 1 through 6. Bible basics bring forth new life. Love one another. Above all, love me. I am coming. And uh, today, I was, I, I didn't get up early, and I got this message kind of late, and, um, you know, I wrote it, and it came out fast, and I was just, you know, like, Lord, did I, did I hear you right? I was kind of rushed, because I had a limited amount of time, and um, I was reluctant to share the word, and I was just praying about it on my way home from work, and he said, to um that I didn't need any more words he gave me the right words and I heard him and um just deliver what he said and speak what he said and then somebody texted me a picture of their shirt and it said imminent and it had the definition of it 
And that's a word like that he said in that message. And my friend had no idea that I received that message. And it was a word I was intending to look up when I got home. So there's confirmation. Um, these words are hard to deliver because it sounds like he's coming like really, really soon. And, um, you know, that's, it weighs heavy on me. It weighs heavy because that's claiming something really, really major and really, really important. And who is just hard to deliver these words right now because they are getting very, um, very real. Like they've taken, I think if you've followed this for a while, things have taken a, a, a new shift. So, um, I mean, it sounds like he's saying like our idea of soon, like our idea of the day is here. Um, that is what he means. It's not a parable, he said. So, um, that's the word I received. So we'll see if, if what he says tomorrow, um, I have no idea when he's coming. I don't know the day or the hour either. I'm waiting just like you are. So God bless you and keep looking up and um, let's keep hoping in the return of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. I love you all. Have a good evening.